Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Ramina for those of you who are new and for those of you who are returning subscribers, welcome back. I know it has been quite a long time since I've uploaded a video, especially like one face to face like this, but I finally got the time to not only get ready today, but also kind of plan my day out as to content. I want to get back into creating more content now that Vito is two months old. I cannot believe Leave. like where has the time gone he's actually right next to me so if you guys hear a little baby he's right here i'll probably show you guys in a second but yes i've been wanting to get more into my content again and i have been uploading i think like once a week they've mainly have been vlogs so if you guys are interested or like vlogs definitely check out my channel um but yeah, I also have really, really good news about the month of October. There's so many things happening and I'm super excited. So for today's video, I wanted to go ahead and show you guys what it is that I carry in my diaper bag every time we have to take Vito anywhere. Like I mentioned, Vito is two months old and I have changed a few things that I would keep in here from like the very beginning of his life. But this is mainly what's in his bag now at two months old. So yeah, first off, this is pretty full as you guys can see. This is my diaper bag and if this doesn't scream Ramina, I don't know what does. My friend Ileana actually purchased this for me for my baby shower and it is from the brand Petunia Pickle Bottom. I've heard a lot of good things about this brand and I honestly do love my diaper bag. So I have a few like inserts and different things that she added onto the diaper bag. This is the beautiful leopard bag here. And I think I'll start with the inside pockets. You happy? <laughs> okay, so inside of the big pocket, I am just going to pull things out. First thing that I have here is my nursing cover. As you guys can see, it is definitely mine because there's like red over it from my hair dye. I really like this nursing cover. I got it from Amazon. I will definitely try to leave most, if not all, the things that I show you guys linked in the description box down below like always but yeah so this is my nursing cover and this i use of course to nurse when i'm on the go sometimes when i go to my in-laws i'll just end up going into one of the rooms but if i'm out let's say anywhere else i will use this nursing cover <gasps> what's up okay next there are quite a few things there's this big pocket right here which in here i have a swaddle, this like chevron swaddle, a burp rag, and this muslim like burp rag as well. I love these, they're really long. I got these from Amazon and they're very, very soft. And then this one is just a burp rag slash like washcloth from Target. So I keep at least two of these in the diaper bag at all times because one, especially the little ones, sometimes will end up falling on the ground and I need to have something else. And then next to it, I have three diapers. These aren't the only diapers that I carry with me. Usually I carry like, I wanna say five to like seven diapers because you never know. He is wearing size two. We just changed his um, diapers right now. And these are the Huggies. Actually, I have one size one in here, but these are the Huggies Little Snugglers, the Disney ones. I saw all over TikTok that those are really good for like blowouts. And to be honest, we are still going through our diapers and wipes that we received at our gender reveal, which if you came to that and gave us wipes or diapers, thank you so much because we have not had to buy any diapers or wipes yet. And if you heard that, that was my little baby pooping. <laughs> I can't make this up guys. Okay, aside from that in here on the other side, I'll just go ahead and go through that, is the diaper pad that comes with the diaper bag. Just looks like this. Use it all the time. And then next to that, I have this little pouch, which I think you can put a bottle in here, but I put other things that I feel are necessary necessary i'm just gonna go through these things i have two disposable bread pads i have some diaper rash cream 
I have some bright water, which we're almost out of. We love this stuff for hiccups. We have the syringe for that. This is probably one of my all-time favorite things. This is a Frida nose, ear, nail picker. It's like a four-in-one type of deal. This is probably my favorite, my all-time favorite thing. This is how it looks like. It is honestly genius and perfect, especially because nowadays... Oh, bless you! Nowadays, Vito has been getting a few boogers and it's really hard because obviously their nostrils are so small. So with this, it's really easy to just pick those boogers out. So that's in there. I also have a little comb just in case. And some newborn face and body lotion that I got in a set. And some Vaseline that we got at the hospital a long time ago just in case so that is all that i keep in here and everything fits pretty nicely so i love that oh, so i love this little pouch then for the middle compartment of the diaper bag i have two main things one of the things being my breast pump. This is the Medela hand pump, and this is probably one of my most favorite things that I own for pumping and breastfeeding. This gets so much milk out of me, and I think one of the main reasons that is is because I added one of these, what are these? The legendary milk um, insert here. I forget what it's called, but if you have this pump, you know that it comes with two little discs but I changed it for one of these. I'll go ahead and link them down below because I saw somebody on TikTok doing that. And I feel like that definitely gets more milk out of me than with the other ones. So I keep this in here because I do like to sometimes pump on the go. I have not been super great at it the past like week and a half, I will say. But prior to that, I was very adamant and really good at pumping all the time on the go. So I have that in here along with this that we got at the hospital just to store some milk some extra milk and we also have some breast pump wipes these i got from target actually victor got this for me from target and then last but not least inside of the big compartment we have one of these pamper little pouches that i actually got at the hospital as well it doesn't match with the whole bag, but it's okay. And here I keep all the wipes and some more diapers. So I have some wipes that just came in this, so like some Pampers wipes, and then we have some water wipes in here. These are my favorite, the hand and face Johnson wipes. These are really good, especially because Vito has had eye gunk coming out of one of his eyes since he was born. So these are good to clean that up really quick. And then we have some of these pacifier wipes, just in case. So all the wipes are in here and I like to keep them in here at all times, just because sometimes with like the face and like hand wipes. In the beginning when I only had one of them, I kept forgetting them. And like I mentioned, he had eye gunk all the time. So um, I bought an extra one to keep one in the diaper bag and keep one with us at all times. So that is in the main compartment. And that's already tripping. I don't even have the <laughs> nursing cover there. I also have this little passy pouch in here, which has two of his like favorite passies honestly he used to love this one i think i bought like four different passies just to know which one he would take and he really liked the tommy tippy ones but lately he's loving these avant ones which i remember when my brother was born like 15 years ago they gave these out at the hospital and he absolutely loves these they're only supposed to be for zero to three months so I don't know what we're going to do after that, but he doesn't use the passies that often. It's mainly just to soothe him and whenever we're going out, we'll give him that. So that's in the little passy pouch. And then in the front, I like to keep, which is definitely a favorite of ours, the sound machine. So this is the Hush 
sound machine we love this i'll use this for even for naps here at home but this for the most part will stay here clipped to the diaper bag and then it does have another compartment in here which in here i just have some hand sanitizer and some like <laughs> these remind me of like doggy bags but i like to keep these just in case whenever we're out and we have a poopy diaper we'll just put the put put them in those bags and then on the other side of the bag, I have a bottle, which this was the first bottle. This is a pigeon bottle, by the way. This was one of the first bottles that we used when transitioning him from breastfeeding to bottle, to taking bottles. Whenever I pump, I, for the most part, will be giving him the milk out of the pigeon bottles. I started using, I also started using the Komotomo bottles and those are pretty good. He likes those as well. But we just bought the Avon ones and we wanted to try those, I think. Then I noticed that there's a zipper back here, but I don't think we ever put anything there. And there's also a zipper in the bottom right here, which I don't have anything in right now, but it's pretty spacious i should probably put my cover there i just have a bib here haven't used that in a while and then last but not least in the front pocket as you guys can see there's so many pockets to this diaper bag and it's super cute i keep all of his extra clothes because if you know anything about babies they will spit up on you he actually just spit up on my shoulder here prior to me starting this video in here i have few changes of clothes we have two onesies i have two pairs of socks some jammies pants and something that i had been that i used a lot in the beginning of my breastfeeding journey this freedom massager i don't use it quite often now but if you have clogged ducts or anything like that this is such a lifesaver I want to show you guys it but yeah it's in here because i would use it quite a bit on the go whenever i didn't have time to like pump every two hours but i haven't used it all that much recently but i'll still keep it in here just in case because trust me once those clock dogs come in you want to get rid of them and yeah so yeah that is all that i have in my diaper bag for my two month old if you enjoyed it as always please do not forget to give it a huge thumbs up as well as subscribe to my channel if you guys are not subscribed already also let me know in the comments down below which videos you guys would like to see from me and hopefully i will get to see you guys on my next one bye guys just kidding we got to show vito say hi vito say hi baby